Hello! When we want to add a new worksheet using Excel VBA, we mainly have to consider two things, where we want to place the new sheet and whether we want to give it a specific name. Let's assume we have a workbook with two worksheets and one chart sheet, like so. If we just want to insert a new worksheet at position 1, we could use this code. If we would like to place it at position 2, we could replace before with after. Oftentimes, we want to put the new worksheet at the very end. For this purpose, we can count the number of sheets and place the new sheet after this number. But here comes a word of caution. Until now, we have used the worksheets command. So, in this example workbook, where we also have a chart sheet, the new worksheet will be placed at position 3, right here not at the end. Let's put it to the test. However, if we want the new worksheet to be added after all sheets, including both worksheets and chart sheets, we could modify our command like this. So, it depends on your specific workbook whether you should refer to worksheets or sheets. Personally, in standard situations, I always use the shorter sheets command. OK, so now that we have the new worksheet created, we might want to rename it. You can simply add this line of code after the line that adds the worksheet. If you prefer a clean one-liner to add and rename the worksheet in a single step, you can do it this way instead. Similarly, we could rewrite our previous statements as shown here. Thanks for watching.